Good day my brothers and sisters. Welcome one more time to Unstop Faith where we're just walking by faith and not by sight. The just shall live by faith. It's very important that we take the word of God and let it transform us that we can be conformed to the image of Christ Jesus that when you see a Christian you see a believer you see Jesus Christ in their life I want to bring another word of encouragement to you hallelujah and it's going to take it from Mark chapter 4 and verse 39 and he arose and rebuked the wind and said unto the sea, Peace, peace, be still. And the wind ceased, and there was a great calm. Peace, be still. I want to bring a word of encouragement to you, titling, Peace, be still. Don't get carried away with everything that's happening around you. Yes, we understand Understand the storm is blowing. We understand that everything may not be going the way you would like it to go. We understand that it may seem with the natural eye that the way I'm behaving is because of my surrounding. I want to go further into what I just said. The way Jesus is behaving is because of his surrounding. Why I say that? Jesus was behaving from the heavenly realm. That's why he could be sleeping when chaos is happening around him. <laughs> so, so Jesus is behaving according to his surrounding. You see, when you surround yourself with the things of God, then you keep your mind on Christ Jesus, then when situation arise that is not from God, you can say, peace and be still. You see, Jesus, speak to the wind. What are you speaking to? Think about that for a moment. What are you speaking to? Because depending on what are you speaking to, if you're speaking to the symptom, then nothing ain't going to happen. If you're going around in the boat and the waves and everything that's happening, the wind is blowing and, and the sea is just roaring and you're like, whoa, I'm going to die. But Jesus know that the wind caused the problem. Jesus focused on the solution. He focused on the root and not the symptom. The boat was rocking. See, that's a part of the symptom. The sea was, oh, because of the symptom. But the root was the wind. My brothers and my sisters, operate from the heavenly realm. Have a heaven mind. Because in a Christ, in a time of crisis, when tribulation and everything that is happening around us and people are losing their mind and terrible things are happening, people are losing their lives and my heart goes out for those who are moaning and crying. But I want to assure you that if you put your faith, if you put your trust in Jesus, then he will turn things around for you. He will teach you these principles are from the kingdom because he walked on earth to give us an example, an example for the believer that we can carry out these principles, these kingdom principles in our lives and that when storm is blowing, he will show us how to locate the root of the problem. So speak to your, your root today. And speak these words, peace, be still. The kid is acting up funny. Whatever is acting up around about you, your bank account not looking good. Peace, be still. <laughs> hallelujah. And the psalmist told us, David, hallelujah. Peace, be still. And know that I am God. God is taking control of every situation. Even when it doesn't happen the way you think it should happen. Just know that God is in the midst. Once you love him and you fear him, his angel will surround you. Because his angel encamp it round and about them that fear the Lord. God bless you. I pray you be encouraged. Go with these words. Read the entire chapter for yourself. And coming back to you again 
every day hallelujah continue to watch this channel go over the videos hallelujah continue to seek god hallelujah god bless you be blessed cause his face to shine upon you and remember now we walk by faith and not by sight god bless you thank you